Heavenly Father, in this sacred and peaceful moment, I come before you with an overflowing heart of gratitude and a spirit that is moved by your boundless grace. You, O Lord, are the creator of the heavens and the earth, the everlasting source of light in every darkness, and the giver of all life. Your works are magnificent and your ways are perfect. I praise you, for you are the God of all comfort, who consoles us in the midst of our troubles, so that we too can comfort others with the same comfort that we have received from you. Lord, I am in awe of your unending love and mercy, for you have bestowed upon me blessings that I do not deserve. Your grace has sustained me through the trials and tribulations of life, and your faithfulness has never wavered. With each passing day, you reveal yourself to me in new and wondrous ways, and your presence fills my heart with peace and joy. I am humbled by the magnitude of your love and the depth of your wisdom. You know the desires of my heart, and you guide me along the path of righteousness. You are my refuge and my strength, my light in the darkness, and my hope for tomorrow. Lord, as I contemplate your goodness and faithfulness, I am reminded of the words of the psalmist, For great is your love, reaching to the heavens, your faithfulness reaches to the skies, Psalm 57 verse 10. I am grateful for the privilege of knowing you and for the gift of your Son, Jesus Christ, who gave his life for me so that I might have eternal life. I offer up my praise and thanks to you, O Lord, for all that you have done, all that you are doing, and all that you will do. May your name be exalted and glorified forevermore. Father, I give thanks and praise to you for the countless times you have shown your power and compassion through miraculous healings. I have witnessed and heard of many instances where you have mended broken bodies and spirits, bringing hope and renewed life. Your power to heal is truly awe-inspiring and a testament to your unfailing love for us. As I reflect on the healings I have witnessed, I am reminded of the psalmist's words, He heals the brokenhearted and binds up their wounds, Psalm 147 verse 3. Your ability to restore and renew is truly remarkable, and I stand in awe of your greatness. Lord, I give thanks for the times you have allowed the sick to recover, the weak to gain strength, and the dying to find life in you again. Your mercy and compassion know no bounds, and your healing touch has brought light and hope to many who were once lost in darkness. I pray for all those who are currently struggling with illness, disease, or any form of affliction. I ask that you would bring healing and comfort to them, and that your love and peace would surround them. May they find strength in you and be encouraged by your unending grace. Father, I give thanks for the countless ways you have shown your love and compassion to us. May we never forget your goodness and mercy, and may we always trust in your unfailing love. Thank you, Almighty God, for the countless breakthroughs in our lives. There were moments when we were lost and all seemed hopeless, but you, in your divine wisdom, made a way where there was no way. Just like how you parted the Red Sea for the Israelites, you have opened doors for us through seemingly impossible situations. Your power is beyond comprehension, and we are humbled by your grace and mercy. We are grateful for your promise. I am making a way in the wilderness and streams in the wasteland. Isaiah 43 verse 19 Your providence has not only sustained us, but has also been a beacon of hope for those who witness your deeds through us. Your love has been a source of comfort and strength, and we are forever grateful for your unwavering presence in our lives. We acknowledge that we don't deserve your goodness, but you have chosen to bless us beyond measure. Your faithfulness has been evident in our lives, and we are confident that you will continue to guide us through the challenges ahead. We pray that you will continue to work in our lives, and that we will honor you with our actions and words. Help us to remember that every breakthrough is a testimony of your power and that we are called to live in a way that brings glory to your name. Thank you, Lord, for the breakthroughs in our lives. We trust in your plan and look forward to the miracles that are yet to come. 
I praise you, Father, for the countless victories that you have bestowed upon us. Through the trials and tribulations of this world, you have been our guiding light, our strength, and our fortress. Your word has been our sword and shield, helping us to overcome even the most insurmountable obstacles. We give thanks to you, for you have given us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. As we walk through the valleys of darkness, we are not afraid, for we know that you are with us. Your presence fills us with courage and hope, and we know that you will never leave us nor forsake us. In you, we find the strength to stand firm against the temptations of this world, to walk righteously in your sight, and to hold fast to the hope of victory that is ours through Christ. Father, we are grateful for the countless blessings that you have bestowed upon us. We are grateful for the victories that we have seen, and for the ones that we have yet to see. We know that you are faithful, and that you will always be there to guide us and protect us. Help us to keep our eyes fixed on you, and to trust in you always, knowing that you are our rock and our salvation. As we go forth into the world, let us do so with confidence and with boldness, knowing that we are victorious in you. Let us be a light to those around us, showing them the hope and the love that can only be found in you. And let us always give thanks to you, for you are the one who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. O oh Lord, we come before you with grateful hearts, acknowledging that everything we have comes from you. You are the source of our every provision, from the air we breathe to the food that sustains us. You have provided us with shelter, clothing, and all that we need to live comfortably. We thank you for the love and care that you have shown us, for the family and friends who surround us, and for the community that supports us. You have given us the ability to work and earn a living, and we are grateful for the opportunities that you have placed before us. Lord, we know that you are our provider in all things, and we trust in your provision for our future needs as well. We ask that you continue to bless us abundantly, and that we may be good stewards of all that you have given us. May our hearts overflow with gratitude and thanksgiving for your goodness and mercy, and may we never take for granted the blessings that you have bestowed upon us. We give you all the honor, glory, and praise, for you are our Jehovah Jireh, the Lord who provides. On this peaceful morning, I lift up those who are struggling and facing challenges in their lives. I pray that they may feel your loving presence and know that you are working for their good, even in the midst of their struggles. May they find comfort in your word, which tells us not to be anxious about anything, but to bring our requests to you in prayer and thanksgiving. Lord, I ask that you give strength and courage to those who are facing difficult situations. May they find comfort in your love and grace, and may they know that you are with them every step of the way. I pray that they may find peace in the midst of their struggles, and that you would help them to overcome their obstacles. Father, I also pray for those who are waiting for their breakthrough or victory. May they hold on to their faith and trust in you, knowing that you are working for their good and that their victory is just around the corner. I pray that you would encourage them and give them hope, reminding them that you are a God of miracles and that nothing is impossible for you. Lord, I ask that you bless each person who is reading this prayer. May they feel your love and presence in their lives, and may they experience your peace that surpasses all understanding. I pray that you would guide them and lead them on the path that you have for them, and that they would have the courage to follow you wherever you may lead. Father, we come before you with grateful hearts, recognizing that every day is a gift from you. We acknowledge that even the smallest blessings are evidence of your love and provision. May we never take for granted the breath in our lungs or the beauty of the world around us, which reflects your glory. Teach us to cherish and steward well the life you have granted us. Help us to be intentional with our time and resources, using them to bring glory to your name and to serve others in your love. 
May we be faithful and responsible in all that you have entrusted to us, knowing that we will one day give an account for how we have lived. We pray that you would give us eyes to see the blessings that are often overlooked and hearts that are filled with gratitude and joy. May our lives be a reflection of your goodness and grace, and may we be a blessing to those around us. We thank you for your unfailing love and faithfulness, and we commit ourselves to living each day with purpose and intention for your glory and the good of others. Lord, as the dawn breaks and the world awakens, we come before you with hearts full of gratitude for the gift of a new day. We thank you for the breath in our lungs, the beating of our hearts, and the countless blessings you have bestowed upon us. As we begin this day, we ask for your guidance and wisdom to lead us on the path that you have set for us. We pray that your Holy Spirit will fill us with a renewed sense of purpose and a deeper faith in you. May we be steadfast in our commitment to follow you and to live out your will in all that we do. Lord, we ask that you protect us from the snares of the enemy and the temptations that seek to lead us astray. We pray that you will shield us from harm and danger, and that you will give us discernment to recognize the lies that the enemy may try to whisper into our ears. Above all, we ask that you equip us to be messengers of your truth and love. May our words and actions reflect your grace and mercy, and may we be a light to those who are lost in darkness. Help us to be agents of change in our world, spreading the message of hope and salvation that can only be found in you. We thank you for your word, which is a lamp for our feet and a light on our path. May we cling to your promises and find strength in your truth. We trust in you, Lord, and we know that you will guide us through this day and every day that follows. As we begin this new day, let us do so with a sense of purpose and intentionality. We can face the challenges that lie ahead with confidence, knowing that the joy of the Lord is our strength. In the midst of all the chaos and uncertainty that surrounds us, it can be easy to become overwhelmed and lost. But we can find peace in the knowledge that the love of God is always with us, guiding us through every moment of our lives. We can let go of our worries and fears and allow the peace of Christ to rule in our hearts, bringing calm and serenity to even the most tumultuous situations. As we go about our day, let us be mindful of the love and grace that God has shown us and let that love guide our every interaction with others. May we be kind and compassionate, showing empathy and understanding to those around us. Let us be quick to forgive, slow to anger, and always ready to extend a helping hand to those in need. So let us go forth into this day with confidence, knowing that we are loved and supported by the God who created us. May we be a source of light and hope to all those we encounter, spreading the love of Christ wherever we go. Dear Lord, I come before you today with a heart full of gratitude and a spirit ready to serve you. I commit this day and all that it holds to your loving care and guidance. I trust that you will lead me through this day, every step of the way. Lord, I pray that you will empower me to live this day for your glory. May I be a shining light to those around me, bearing fruit in every good work and growing in the knowledge of your truth. Help me to be patient, kind, and gracious to all I encounter, just as you have been to me. I know that this day holds challenges and obstacles, but I also know that nothing is impossible with you. When I face difficulties, help me to lean on your strength and wisdom. When I am tempted to sin, remind me of your holy standards and empower me to choose what is right. Lord, I praise you for your faithfulness, your mercy, and your love. Thank you for the gift of this new day. May I use it to bring glory and honor to your name. In the mighty and precious name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Almighty and everlasting God, I come before your throne with a heart that yearns for purity and a spirit that desires strength. You are the Holy One of Israel, the Redeemer of all who call upon your name. 
In this moment of stillness, I seek your divine assistance to overcome every form of sexual temptation, every evil motive, and every corrupt thought that may seek to take hold of my mind and heart. Father, you alone know the struggles I face and the weaknesses that I battle against. I ask that you would create in me a clean heart, renew a right spirit within me, and help me to walk in the path of righteousness. Grant me the strength to resist all forms of temptation and to flee from every appearance of evil. Help me to keep my thoughts pure and my words kind, and to reflect your love and grace in all that I do. Lord, I pray for your protection and guidance as I navigate this world. Help me to discern what is good and what is evil, and to choose the path that leads me closer to you. Give me the wisdom to make wise decisions and the courage to stand firm in my faith even when faced with opposition or ridicule. I know that I cannot do this on my own, and so I ask for your help and your grace. Strengthen my resolve and give me the faith to trust in your provision and protection. May your Holy Spirit guide me in all that I do, and may your love be evident in every aspect of my life. Dear Lord, you have called us to be holy, just as you are holy. In a world that is filled with temptations and trials, I seek your divine grace to stand firm. May your word always be a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path, guiding me away from the snare set by the enemy. I know that I cannot do this on my own, but with you by my side, I can overcome any obstacle. I pray that you grant me the strength and vigilance to guard my eyes, my thoughts, and my desires, that they may be pleasing in your sight. Help me to remember that I am called to live a life that is set apart, and that the world's standards are not always aligned with your will. May your Holy Spirit guide me in making the right choices so that I may always walk in your truth and your ways. As I navigate through this journey of life, I pray that you would help me to keep my focus on you and that you would fill me with your wisdom and discernment. May I always be quick to repent when I fall short and may your grace be sufficient to cover all my weaknesses. Thank you for your unfailing love and faithfulness towards me. I pray that I may always honor you with my life and that I may be a shining light in this dark world. May you will be done in my life always. Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, I boldly declare victory over every form of sexual temptation that seeks to ensnare me. Your word declares that greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. 1 John 4 verse 4 I choose to believe this truth and stand firm on it. Lord, I acknowledge that sexual temptation is a real and persistent struggle, but I also know that you have promised to provide a way of escape for every temptation that comes my way. I ask that you give me the discernment and wisdom to recognize these exits and the courage to walk through them. I pray that you would protect my mind from harmful influences that seek to distort my thinking and lead me astray. Help me to take every thought captive and make it obedient to Christ, 2 Corinthians 10 verse 5. Father, I ask that you would guard my heart with your truth. Help me to meditate on your word day and night so that I may be able to resist the lies of the enemy and stand firm in your promises. I thank you. Lord, for your faithfulness and your unfailing love. I know that with you on my side, I am more than a conqueror, Romans 8 verse 37. I trust in your strength and power to overcome any temptation that comes my way. I boldly and unashamedly rebuke every evil motive that may try to take root within me. I recognize that the Holy Spirit dwells within me, convicting and guiding me towards righteousness. Therefore, I am determined to be sensitive to his gentle nudging, turning away from any selfish ambitions or desires that may wage war against my soul. I fully embrace the truth of Romans 8 verse 5, which says, For those who live according to the flesh set their minds on the things of the flesh, but those who live according to the Spirit set their minds on the things of the Spirit. I choose to live by the Spirit, setting my mind on what is good, true, 
and honorable. I reject any thought or action that is contrary to the will of God. I pray that the Holy Spirit will bear fruit in abundance in my life. May I demonstrate love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control in everything I do. I surrender my will to God's will, trusting that He will guide me along the path of righteousness. Lord, I thank you for the gift of your Holy Spirit. I pray that He will continually transform me from the inside out, making me more like Jesus every day. I ask for the courage and strength to resist the temptations of the flesh and to follow your Spirit wherever He leads me. May my life be a shining example of your love and grace to all who encounter me. O oh, Almighty God, I come before you seeking your divine intervention in my thought life. In a world where the influences of sin and darkness are abundant, I ask that you cleanse my mind from any evil thoughts that may have taken root. I pray that your light will shine brightly in my mind and heart, illuminating every dark corner and banishing all negative and ungodly thoughts. Lord, I know that your word teaches us that whatever we dwell on will ultimately shape our actions and attitudes. Therefore, I ask that you help me to focus on what is true, noble, right, pure, lovely, admirable, excellent, and praiseworthy. May my mind be filled with thoughts that are good and edifying, so that I may experience the peace that surpasses all understanding. I acknowledge that I am weak and unable to overcome the temptations that come my way on my own strength. Therefore, I ask that you give me the strength and grace to resist every evil thought and temptation. Help me to take every thought captive and make it obedient to Christ. May your Holy Spirit guide me in every moment of my life, helping me to think and act in a way that is pleasing to you. I ask all these things in the name of Jesus Christ, my Lord and Savior. Lord, I come before you today with boldness and confidence, knowing that victory is found in surrendering to your will. Your Son, Jesus, demonstrated this on the cross, and I desire to follow his example. Help me to daily take up my cross, denying ungodliness and worldly passions, and to live a self-controlled, upright, and godly life in this present age. I know that I am not perfect, but I choose to strive towards holiness and righteousness in every aspect of my life. May my body be a temple of the Holy Spirit, honored and kept pure. I offer my body as a living sacrifice, holy and pleasing to you, as this is my spiritual act of worship. I know that I am called to be set apart and to live a life that reflects your glory and love to those around me. I pray that you would strengthen me with your power and fill me with your spirit so that I can live a life that brings you honor and glory. Thank you for your love and grace and for the privilege of being your child. Lord, I come before you today with a heart filled with gratitude and a spirit of perseverance. I thank you for the strength and courage that you have given me to face the challenges of life. I am grateful for the people you have placed in my life who have helped me along the way. I pray for those who struggle alongside me on this journey. May we encourage one another and build each other up as we strive to live lives worthy of the calling we have received. I pray that we will be accountable to one another, speaking the truth in love and walking together in the light of your presence. Lord, I know that this journey is not easy, but with you by our side, we can overcome any obstacle. I pray that you will give us the strength to persevere and the wisdom to make the right decisions. Help us to lean on you and trust in your plan for our lives. I ask that you bless our relationships and make them strong and healthy. May we be people of integrity, always seeking to do what is right and pleasing to you. May our words and actions reflect your love and grace. Lord, I pray that you will use us to make a difference in the world. Help us to be a light in the darkness, bringing hope and healing to those around us. May we be vessels of your love, sharing your message of salvation with everyone we meet. 
Thank you, Lord, for the privilege of serving you. May we honor you with our lives and bring glory to your name. Heavenly Father, we come before you today with hearts full of gratitude and reverence. As the sun rises and a new day begins, we ask for your divine intervention in our lives. We pray for a renewed spirit and strengthened resolve to face the challenges of the day ahead. Equip us with your armor, the belt of truth, the breastplate of righteousness, the shoes of the gospel of peace, the shield of faith, the helmet of salvation, and the sword of the spirit, which is your word. We desire to stand firm against all the strategies of the devil and resist his temptations. Lord, we acknowledge that we are weak and prone to sin, but we trust in your unfailing love and grace to sustain us through every trial and temptation. Help us to be watchful and alert, always ready to fight the good fight of faith. We pray for your protection over our families, friends, and loved ones. Keep them safe from harm and danger, and guide them in your ways. We also lift up our leaders, both in the church and in our communities. Grant them wisdom and discernment to make good decisions and lead with integrity. Lord, we ask that you bless this day and guide us in all our ways. May your will be done in our lives, and may we bring glory and honor to your name. Thank you, Lord, for your boundless mercy and unyielding patience with us, even when we fall short and stray from your path. Your faithfulness spans the heavens, and your steadfast love knows no bounds. As we face the trials and temptations of this world, let us remember that we do not fight for victory, but from victory that you have already secured for us on the cross. Give us the strength and wisdom to resist the devil's schemes and to stand firm in our faith, rooted in your truth and love. May your spirit guide us and empower us to live lives that honor and glorify you, spreading your light and love to a world in need. In the powerful and precious name of Jesus, we pray, Amen. Heavenly Father, in this moment of stillness before the dawn, I come to you with a heart full of hope and a spirit seeking guidance. I approach your divine throne with reverence and gratitude, acknowledging your sovereignty over all creation and recognizing your infinite wisdom and love. As I reflect on the sacred bonds of marriage and the intricate ties of family, I am humbled by the complexity and beauty of human relationships. I am reminded that you are the author of love and the creator of human connection, and that it is only through your grace and guidance that we can navigate the challenges and joys of life together. I pray for all those who are struggling in their marriages or families that you would grant them wisdom, patience, and grace to overcome their difficulties. I pray for those who are experiencing conflict or division that you would bring healing and reconciliation to their relationships. I pray for those who are facing uncertainty or fear that you would give them strength and courage to face whatever challenges lie ahead. Above all, I pray that love would be the foundation of all our relationships as you have commanded us to do. May we love one another as you have loved us with a selfless and sacrificial love that seeks the good of others above our own desires. May we be patient, kind, and forgiving bearing with one another in humility and gentleness. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for the gift of marriage and family and for the blessing of human connection. May we always honor and cherish the relationships that you have given us and may we glorify you in all that we do. Lord, we come before you in the reverence and holiness of marriage. We recognize that in this sacred union, you have brought together two lives to reflect the unity of Christ and the church. However, we also acknowledge our humanity and how often we falter in our commitment to one another. We ask for your abundant grace to permeate our hearts and homes that our marriages may not only endure but thrive in the light of your love. Teach us to love relentlessly and sacrificially just as Jesus loves the church giving himself up for her to make her holy. 
May we be willing to lay down our own desires and agendas for the sake of our spouse, just as Christ laid down his life for us. May our love be selfless and unconditional, that we may reflect the agape love that you have for us. We pray that our homes will be a sanctuary of your presence, where forgiveness, patience, and compassion reign. May our marriages be a testimony to the world of your faithfulness and love, and may we be an example of the kind of love that you have for all your children. Lord, we come before you today with humble hearts, seeking your guidance and wisdom as we interact with one another in our various relationships. We recognize that we are imperfect beings and that we need your help to navigate the challenges that arise in our interactions with each other. Grant us the patience to listen deeply to one another, to truly hear what is being said and to understand each other's perspectives. Help us to speak truthfully, even when it is difficult, and to do so with love and compassion. We ask that you give us the humility to admit our faults and to seek forgiveness when we have wronged one another. Lord, we pray that the words of our mouths and the meditations of our hearts will always be pleasing to you. May we honor you in all that we say and do, and may our interactions with one another reflect your love and grace. Help us to bear with one another in love, even when we disagree or when tensions arise. May we always be eager to maintain the unity of the Spirit in the bond of peace, recognizing that we are all part of your family and that we need each other to grow and thrive. We thank you for your love and your grace, and we ask that you continue to guide us in all that we do. Father, I come before you today with a heavy heart, praying for marriages that are strained and on the brink of breaking. I know that you are the God of restoration and healing, and I trust that you can do the impossible in these situations. Lord, I pray that you would revive the love that has grown cold in these marriages. Bring back the passion and affection that once existed, and renew the commitment that was made before you. Help these couples to remember the beauty of their union and the promises that they made to one another. Father, I ask that you would mend the bonds that have been broken in these marriages. Heal the wounds that have been inflicted by hurtful words and actions, and restore the trust that has been lost. Bring peace to the hearts of these couples and help them to forgive one another as you have forgiven them. Lord, I pray that you would provide these couples with the strength to seek reconciliation. Give them the courage to admit their mistakes and to seek forgiveness and help them to be humble and gracious in their interactions with one another. Help them to communicate openly and honestly and to work towards a resolution that is pleasing to you. Father, I pray for wisdom for these couples. Help them to know when to seek help from others, whether it be from a trusted friend, a pastor, or a professional counselor. Give them discernment to know what steps to take to restore their marriage, and help them to trust in you to guide them on this journey. Lord, I pray that your spirit would guide these couples back to the path of mutual respect and affection. Help them to honor one another as you have commanded us to do, and to love one another as you have loved us. May their marriage be a testimony of your grace and mercy, and a shining example of what a godly marriage should be. Heavenly Father, we come before you with hearts full of gratitude for the gift of family. We acknowledge that families are not always perfect, and that disagreements and conflicts can arise, causing division and hurt. But we also know that you have called us to love one another deeply and to seek unity and harmony in our relationships. We pray for our broader family circle, Lord. We ask that you bless each member with your grace, peace, and understanding. Help us to honor one another, to show kindness and compassion, and to bear each other's burdens. May our families be places of refuge and comfort where we can find support and encouragement in times of need. We know that building strong relationships takes time, effort, and patience. We ask for your guidance and wisdom as we navigate the ups and downs of family life. Help us to communicate with one another in love, 
to listen with empathy, and to forgive each other when we fall short. Above all, Lord, we pray that our families would be a reflection of your love and grace. May we be a shining light in a world that is often filled with darkness and discord. We ask for your blessing on our families, and we commit to doing our part to strengthen the bonds of love and unity that hold us together. Thank you, Lord, for the gift of family. May we always cherish and honor this precious gift, and may our relationships be a testimony to your goodness and faithfulness. O oh Lord, I come before you today to pray for those whose hearts have become hardened by past hurts and misunderstandings. I know that pain and disappointment can cause us to build walls around our hearts, making it difficult for us to trust or love again. But I also know that you are a God of healing and restoration. You are able to soften even the hardest of hearts with your grace and love. So I ask that you would pour out your grace upon those who are struggling in this way. Help them to see that you are with them and that you care deeply about their pain. I pray that you would also let your peace, which surpasses all understanding, guard their hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. May they find comfort and strength in your presence, and may they be reminded that you are the ultimate source of all true peace and joy. Lord, I ask that you would inspire us all to pursue peace and reconciliation, as you have called us to do. Help us to forgive as freely as you have forgiven us, and to extend grace and love to those who have hurt us. May we be instruments of your peace and reconciliation in this world, bringing healing and restoration to those who need it most. Thank you, Lord, for your amazing grace and love. May we always remember that you are with us, and that you are able to do immeasurably more than we could ever ask or imagine. Almighty God, in every interaction that takes place within our family, we pray that we may be swift to listen, slow to speak, and slow to anger. We acknowledge that human anger does not bring about the righteousness that you desire, and so we ask for your help in keeping our emotions in check. May our homes be filled with the fruit of the Holy Spirit, which includes love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. We ask that you would help us to cultivate these virtues within ourselves and in our relationships with each other. Lord, we know that family dynamics can be challenging at times, and we ask for your grace and wisdom as we navigate the ups and downs of life together. When disagreements arise, help us to approach each other with humility and a willingness to listen. When we are tempted to respond in anger or frustration, remind us of your great love for us and the example of Christ, who showed us how to love even our enemies. We also pray for unity within our family. Help us to prioritize our relationships with each other and to work towards common goals. May our love for one another be evident to those around us, and may we be a witness to your grace and goodness. In all things, may you be glorified within our family. Dear God, we come before you today with grateful hearts, acknowledging that you are the giver of all good gifts. We thank you for the families you have given us, for the love and support we receive from one another, and for the many blessings you have bestowed upon us. As we go about our daily lives, we know that we will face challenges and difficulties. We ask that you would provide us with the assurance of your constant presence, that we may have the strength and courage to face whatever comes our way. May we always remember that you are with us, guiding and directing us, and may we draw our strength and comfort from you. We pray that each member of our families would feel valued and loved, not just by one another, but by you, the perfect Father. May we treat one another with kindness, respect, and compassion, and may we always seek to build one another up rather than tear one another down. May our relationships be a testament to your grace and a light to others, drawing them to your love and truth. We ask for your wisdom and guidance in all that we do, that we may make wise decisions and act in accordance with your will. Help us to love one another as you have loved us, 
to forgive one another as you have forgiven us, and to always seek your will above our own. We thank you, God, for your never-ending love and mercy. May we always turn to you in times of need, and may our lives be a reflection of your goodness and grace. Father, we come before you this morning with hearts full of gratitude for the gift of another day. We recognize that each day is a precious opportunity to love and serve you, and to love and serve one another. We ask that you renew our spirits and refresh our love for one another as we embark on this new day. Guide us, Lord, in every conversation, decision, and action. May your wisdom and discernment be our guide as we navigate the challenges and opportunities that lie ahead. Help us to be patient, kind, and understanding with one another, and to always seek the good of the other. Protect our relationships from the attacks of the evil one. We know that he seeks to divide and conquer, to sow discord and mistrust. But we trust in your power to overcome evil with good. May our love for you and for one another be a powerful witness to the world of your grace and mercy. Lord, we know that there will be hardships and misunderstandings along the way. But we ask that you would help us to persevere through them, to forgive one another, and to grow in our love for you and for each other. Let nothing separate us from your love or from each other. We entrust this day and our relationships to your loving care. May we glorify you in all that we say and do, and may our love for one another be a reflection of your perfect love. We lift up our families to you, Lord, with hearts full of gratitude for the gift of family. We acknowledge that you are the foundation of our families, and we surrender our relationships to your loving care. We trust that, with you at the center, no obstacle is too great to overcome. We pray that our families would be a reflection of your love for us. May we love each other unconditionally, just as you love us. May our love be unending, never fading away even in the face of challenges. And may our love be unyielding, always persevering through the tough times. Lord, we know that family relationships can be complex and difficult at times. But we also know that you have the power to heal, restore, and renew even the most broken relationships. We pray that you would bring healing where there is hurt, restoration where there is brokenness, and renewal where there is stagnation. In the powerful name of Jesus, who brought us into your family and binds us all together in perfect harmony, we pray for our families. May our relationships be a testimony to your love and grace, and may our families be a source of joy, strength, and support for each other. Amen. Lord God Almighty, in the stillness of this early morning, I come before you as a humble servant, seeking transformation in my heart and the hearts of your people. As the world around me slumbers, my spirit stirs with a deep longing for your divine touch in my relationships, with my spouse, my family, and all those I encounter, whether friend or stranger. You are the embodiment of love itself, and you call us to love one another as you have loved us. Your commandment is clear, love one another. As I have loved you, so you must love one another, John 13 verse 34. Yet, we often fall short of this call, allowing our own selfish desires and the distractions of the world to cloud our hearts and minds. Lord, I pray that you would fill me with your love and transform me from the inside out. Help me to see others as you see them, with compassion and understanding. Give me the strength to love even when it's difficult, to forgive even when I've been wronged, and to extend grace to those who may not deserve it. And as I seek transformation in my own heart, I also pray for your transformation in the hearts of your people around the world. May you break down the walls of hate and division that separate us, and may your love be the unifying force that brings us together in peace and harmony. Thank you, Lord, for your unfailing love and grace. May I always be a vessel of your love to those around me, and may your love shine through me in all that I do. Father, 
I come before you with a humble heart, seeking your divine intervention in my marriage. I pray for the grace to love my spouse with a pure and fervent heart, unconditionally and selflessly, as you have loved us. Lord, I acknowledge that there may be times of discord and misunderstanding in our relationship, but I pray that in those moments, you will remind us of the covenant we made before you. Help us to uphold the vows we made, to love and cherish one another through all seasons of life, in sickness and in health, for richer or poorer, till death do us part. I ask that you infuse our relationship with your love, which is patient and kind, not envious or boastful, not arrogant or rude, but always seeking the good of the other. Let our love be a testament to your enduring mercy and faithfulness, so that others may see and marvel at the beauty of the union you have created between us. Lord, I pray that you will heal any wounds, forgive any hurts, and restore any brokenness in our marriage. May your Holy Spirit guide us in our interactions with one another, so that we may always speak truth and love, and be quick to forgive. I ask all this in the name of Jesus Christ, who taught us to love one another as he has loved us. May our marriage reflect his sacrificial love and bring glory to your name. Dear Lord, we come before you seeking your guidance and wisdom in our interactions with our families. We acknowledge that family dynamics can often be challenging and stressful, leading us to respond in ways that are not always gentle or loving. We ask that you extend your gentle hand upon our interactions with our families, especially during times of turmoil and stress. Help us to respond with a spirit of gentleness, remembering that a gentle answer turns away wrath, but a harsh word stirs up anger. Proverbs 15 verse 1 Grant us the wisdom to navigate family dynamics with grace, upholding peace, and nurturing the bonds that unite us. Help us to be mindful of our words and actions, and to respond with patience and understanding, even in difficult situations. We pray that you would strengthen our relationships with our families, deepening our love for one another and helping us to grow together in faith and love. May our families be a place of refuge and support, where we can find comfort and encouragement in times of need. We trust in your unfailing love and guidance, and we ask that you would bless our families with your grace and peace. Lord, we come before you today seeking your guidance and patience as we engage with those who may not share our beliefs or values. We recognize that in our own lives, we were once far from you, and it was only through your grace that we were brought near to you. We ask that you help us extend that same grace and patience to others. We know that it can be easy to judge or disdain those who are different from us, but we ask that you help us to see them through your eyes. May we have compassion and understanding for their struggles and challenges, and may we be willing to listen to their perspectives with an open heart and mind. Lord, we know that unity is important to you, and we ask that you help us to be patient and loving with one another. May we bear with one another in love, even when it is difficult or uncomfortable. And may we make every effort to keep the unity of the Spirit through the bond of peace. We trust in your wisdom and guidance, Lord, and we ask that you help us to be patient and compassionate in all our interactions with others. May your love shine through us and draw others closer to you. O oh God, we come before you today with a bold request. We ask that you impart to us a heart of kindness towards those who are unkind, even in a world that is quick to anger and slow to forgive. We recognize that this is no easy task, but we trust in your power to transform us and to guide us in all things. We know that it is easy to respond to hostility with more hostility, to meet harshness with harshness. But you have called us to a higher standard, one that reflects your unconditional love and your boundless grace. You have shown us that kindness is a powerful force, one that can break down barriers and sow seeds of light in the darkest places. So we ask that you empower us to respond to unkindness with kindness, to overcome evil with good. 
We ask that you give us the courage to extend grace to those who do not deserve it and to love our enemies as you have loved us. We ask that you help us to see others through your eyes and to recognize the inherent value and dignity of every human being. We know that this is not a task we can undertake on our own, but we trust in your strength and your wisdom to guide us. We know that with you, all things are possible and that your love can triumph over even the most hardened heart. So we commit ourselves to this task, knowing that in doing so, we are reflecting your goodness and your light to the world around us. May our actions be a testimony to your love and your grace, and may we be a beacon of hope in a world that so desperately needs it. Father, we come before you as humble servants, recognizing that we are not in control of our lives, but you are the one who holds our future. We acknowledge that we are here to serve your kingdom and not our own selfish desires. Help us to put aside our pride and selfishness and to be guided by your wisdom and love. Lord, we ask that you give us a servant's heart, just like Jesus had when he walked on earth. He set an example of humility, and he showed us that the greatest among us is the one who serves. Help us to follow his footsteps, to put others before ourselves, and to love them as you do. We pray that you guide us in our daily interactions, that we may always be mindful of the needs of those around us. Help us to be compassionate, patient, and understanding, even when it is difficult. Give us the strength to resist the temptations of power and control, and to seek instead to serve others in every situation. Father, we ask that you clothe us in your grace, that we may be filled with your love and mercy. Help us to be faithful servants, doing your will and bringing glory to your name. May our lives be a testament to your goodness and grace, and may others be drawn to you through our humble service. Father, we come before you today with boldness and confidence, knowing that you are the source of all wisdom and understanding. We ask that you would fill us with your Holy Spirit and guide us in every situation so that our first instinct is to act out of love and reflect your holy character. We pray that as we interact with others, whether in the comfort of our homes or in the broader community, we would be anchored in the fruits of the Spirit. May our lives be characterized by love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. May we be a shining example of your grace and truth to all those around us. Help us to remember that these fruits are not just suggestions, but rather they are the very essence of who you are. May we strive to live out these qualities in every aspect of our lives, and may they be evident in our words and actions. We ask that you would empower us to love others as you love us, to extend grace and forgiveness freely, and to be agents of reconciliation in a world that is so desperately in need of it. May our lives be a reflection of your love, and may we be a light in the darkness, pointing others to you. We recognize, O oh Lord, that without your divine intervention, the virtues of love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control are unattainable through our own efforts. We come before you with a humble heart, seeking your guidance and assistance in developing these qualities in our lives. We acknowledge that we have fallen short in the past and have not always lived up to your standards. We ask for your forgiveness for our shortcomings and for the strength to persevere in our pursuit of these virtues. We understand that these characteristics are not mere attributes we can acquire overnight, but a lifetime of work and dedication. We pray that you help us to remain steadfast in our pursuit of them and that you give us the wisdom to recognize opportunities for growth and change. We commit ourselves to living a life that is pleasing to you, offering ourselves as a living sacrifice to your service. May our actions and thoughts reflect the character of Christ, and may we be a light in the darkness, shining your love and grace to those around us. We thank you, O Lord, for the gift of your Holy Spirit, who empowers us to live a life that is pleasing to you, 
and we ask that you continue to guide us as we seek to grow in love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. As the radiant sun rises and illuminates the world, we renew our unwavering dedication to live by your divine commandments each day. May your infinite love and grace shield us from the snares of the evil one and empower us to resist the enticements that seek to lead us astray from your righteous path. May every thought, word, and action be a testimony of our steadfast faith and devotion to you. May our lives reflect the beauty of your holiness and the power of your redemptive love. May our hearts be steadfast and unwavering, anchored in the truth of your word and fortified by the strength of your spirit. As we embark on the journey of this new day, may we walk in the light of your truth, guided by the wisdom of your Holy Spirit. May we be vessels of your peace, agents of your love, and bearers of your light to a world in desperate need of your healing touch. In all things, may we glorify you, the one true God, who reigns supreme over all creation, now and forevermore. Thank you, Almighty God, for your infinite mercy and unfailing presence in our lives. We are grateful for your constant love and guidance, which lead us through the ups and downs of life. Help us to be mindful of the needs of those around us, to love our spouse with undivided devotion, to treat our family with gentleness, to extend patience to sinners, and to show kindness to the unkind. Lord, you have given us the ultimate example of love through your Son, Jesus Christ. His sacrificial love and compassion for all people inspire us to follow in his footsteps and to carry his light into every corner of our lives. Help us to be a beacon of hope and love to those around us, reflecting your love and grace in all that we do. We pray for your strength and wisdom to navigate the challenges that we face each day. May your peace and comfort be with those who are hurting, and your healing touch be upon those who are sick. We pray for your protection and guidance over our nation, our leaders, and our communities. In the mighty and precious name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. We believe this prayer has added virtue to your faith and is already active in your life. We invite you to share your response by commenting, Amen. Your engagement is more than just support. It's a way to spread hope and faith. If you feel inspired, please share this video with your friends and family. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more daily prayers that uplift and inspire. Your involvement is invaluable to us. We also welcome your prayer requests. Feel free to leave them in the comments. And together, as a community, we will bring them before God. Your faith and our collective prayers can create a powerful force for blessings and victory. Remember, you're not just a viewer. You're a vital part of this journey of faith. Each like, share, and subscription helps us reach more hearts every day. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ accompany you always.